The book is being promoted as the first inside account of the raid on Osama bin Laden's compound. It's written by one of the U.S. Navy SEALs who led the assault. While much has already been disclosed about the raid, the publisher of the book, Dutton, quotes author Mark Owen as writing, it is time to set the record straight about one of the most important missions in U.S. military history. No easy day is the story of the guys, the human toll we pay, and the sacrifices we make to do this dirty job. Sources say Owen, who is no longer a SEAL, did not get his manuscript approved as required by the Pentagon, the White House, or the CIA. Owen could face legal problems if the government determines his book discloses classified information that could harm U.S. national security. But his publisher is more concerned that Owen himself could face physical danger, retaliation from al-Qaeda or bin Laden sympathizers, now that his identity has been revealed by Fox News and the Associated Press. In a statement, Dutton said Owen has put his life on the line time and again for his country for more than a decade. We respectfully request that all news organizations consider these facts when deciding whether to pursue or publicize his real identity. Now, legal experts tell us there's a remote chance that whoever leaked Owen's identity could ultimately be prosecuted for disclosing the name of a covert intelligence officer. Remember, while he was a SEAL employed by the Pentagon, Scott, the bin Laden raid, in fact, was directed by the Central Intelligence Agency. Bob, thank you. And an editor's note, 60 Minutes has interviewed the SEAL who wrote the book under the name Mark Owen. On September 9th, 60 Minutes will carry his first-person account on the killing of bin Laden. The book, No Easy Day, will be released on September 11th.